Well, hello, everybody. Welcome back to another wonderful day of Charlotte Wars Adventure in Factorio. Well, here we go. Another episode. Excellent, hey? So, I, I'm recording these kind of back-to-back, kind of not. So, j just be aware of that. I might say so a lot, and I'll try not to. Because I hate that when other people do that, too. And, yeah, and then look at me, you know. <laughs> Doing the exact same thing as, as, as anyone else. So I think we can s safely dismantle this stuff. Blah. Talking's been kind of difficult there. What? There's no power? Oh, oh. Why not? Oh, I know why. So we need to make sure... Let's see, this will power this side, so we need to keep that line intact, which means that we need to do this and this. Something like that. Sure, can I remove that? Just not, just not far enough. There we go. There we go. Okay, so we're going to dismantle this this part here because we don't need this. This part here is no good. Okay, let's see. So how are you all doing? I am doing great, as always. We have a, a new addition to our family, which is, is quite challenging at times, but all is good in the hood, so to speak. <laughs> oh, that's funny. You know, Lush Echo is doing some cool stuff. He's doing some cool live streaming. Uh, definitely check him out on Twitch. Just go look up Lush Echo. I will have the link in the description below. And also, if I can, I will try and put the... I Actually, I can't put the link in the cards. That's only internal you know, YouTube things you can do that with. I find it very limiting at my level. Man, that was an interruption. You know, it'll be edited out, of course, but... Well, what was I saying? Oh, gosh. I was saying about something. Now I've forgotten because the conversation I had uh, threw me off track. I would normally write things down, but hey, I just fly by the seat of my pants because it's way more interesting. I don't like to have scripted things because it just gets boring. So this is still producing. It's not producing very fast. Yeah, okay, no, it's producing good. Okay, yeah, we were talking about walls and expansion and blah, 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 last episode. I need to put some gates down here. So let's build some gates. Five, ten. Looks like I need more circuits. Am I taking circuits off the line? Not really, but it is behind a bit. Oh, we're done the research. The research is going to go a lot faster. This is the better transmission lines, so we get the medium electric poles, which take steel and copper, and we get the big electric poles, which take steel and copper. That is interesting. I'm going to have to put steel on the bus. Hmm. No, maybe not. Maybe not. Nah, let's research this and see what happens. Because I can take steel we're making down here. I thought I was. Yeah, right here. So we can kind of take it from here. See, we have it on, on, like we want it to, be, uh, it to make as much steel as possible. So that's what it's doing. Is just it takes a long time in these furnaces. We need to upgrade the furnaces, which we will do that probably. We need to, we need to increase production, but the belts are competing. We almost need to create separate lines for each of these. So let's do that actually. So I'm going to going to sever the link again. We're going to split this apart by one space. Yeah, cuz we have enough room to 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 work with to do that. Basically, this is what we're going to do. Hey, so shift R. Ah, that's so nice. That's so nice. Okay, so now we're going to want one of each to come in. 
So we're going to need some long-handed inserters. One, two, three, four. Looks like we need iron. So we're going to grab iron from here. One. Actually, let's just take all of it. Okay. Uh, we need to put the copper into here. And then we need to put the iron into here. Yeah, there's just the little bits and odds and ends that end up in your inventory every so often. It's frustrating, but it happens. Okay. So we have these. So these, let's put these longer ones like that. Then we gotta do the same. So then there's gonna be two belts, right? It's gonna be this belt. Then there's gonna be this belt. So then we need to do these bad boys. Wait a second. No, oh, I can think I can I think we can do the like this. We have to see how this works in in actuality. And I need some of these, so like this. I can I can get away with doing it like this. And then we just need this the yellow ones. The yellow ones. Oh gosh. That's hilarious. Um I know you can do some control clicking and right clicking and blah blah blah. But man, I just can't remember. So let's fix this up so it looks a little bit better. Do that. And now we can add power. And let's see here. How do we add power? That. That and that. And we can add a light in somewhere. Where's the light? Let me put a light. We have a light here. So we can put them on the edges here. We can do a light here and a light here. That would work. What's my draw on? Looks like we're still good with the draw. I do want to build solar at some point as well. Because that is very effective as well for for power generation. So now we're going to build more circuits, which we should see more circuits coming down this way. Oh yeah, and <laughs> need to finish what we we're going to do here. What were we doing with all that stuff? Are we building these things? Electronic? I think so. So now we can go back to this. Wanted to kind of... Um, but I should have maybe went one up, so I'm going to have to Finagle it, which is fine. What I'll do is I'll do this. I'll make it go around like this and then down like that. And maybe even like that. And that way then we can do this. So this thing will make this. The plates. Oh, how many plates? 20 plates, 10 gears, and 5 of those. Okay. I think we can just do that and then put in one of those and then we can just do this uh, maybe not like that maybe like this and then we put that there we can make it produce one stack that's all we're gonna ever need and now we can power it up so let's see let's bring the power across no we can't bring the power across the lines we will, but we just can't right now. We have to place all of these and connect them up. Like so. That way then we have this area available to us. And let's see here what else what else am I seeing? Mm -mm -mm. Or is it oh it's taking it for the arms. See for these bad boys here. Because this is probably not backed up fully. Yeah. So this needs to be... There needs to be more production of these. Looks like it's working. Maybe. Nah, see the copper cable. We need to change the powering of this change powering how do we power this stuff I want to put a third mm. I'm 
just thinking here out loud and what we have set up here isn't really going as good as we need it to go. I wish we could reverse the two lines here. Flip them around, but that would take more space. You need to split them up to work with that. Yeah, let's just put the power back. See, these red ones are going slow. I think if I push this over by one, we could fit in a third one. So, for example, if we did that, 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 and that. Okay. Then we place these here and here. Then we can put the circuits in play again. Okay. And then what we can do is we can... Oh, we can't extend it though. We need to move this out one more. Yeah, we need to extend this out. Oop. One, two, like that. Okay, so now we got more room to work with. <laughs> and what we're going to do is we're going to basically move this one down this way, one down that way. And we're going to add in some more long handed inserters. 5, 10, 15, 20. Let's make a whole bunch of those. And we'll probably do it like so. One, two. Let's so add some more power. How's these going? These are going okay. I'm going to throw wood into here again because <laughs> it just it works and it's okay. Oh, look at all this. Why isn't the coal maxed out? Hmm, we'll have to speed that up. That way then we can deposit more coal and then we can stick a whole bunch of this stuff in here. Like so. That wood in there. Stuff is just chewing up the the resources. Oh, there's extra steam down here. So these two are constantly being in, in use. Looks like this is still functioning as expected. Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Okay. Just thinking here. Just thinking, just thinking what to do. So it looks like that was working. Oh, I don't have the outline or the, the outbound. So it looks like that extra. Let's see here. Looks like the extra arm is helping. Maybe. Maybe let's put another couple arms like this. Some slower ones. And we need some more power. Yeah, this power is getting sloppy here, but whatever. Let's see how these arms are functioning now. But we did kind of increase production. And then, then now what we can do with this is we can carry it downwards. And so what we'll do is we'll, is, is, is we'll flip them and create maybe two more here. Or like four more, a, a, a block of four more to put back into this. So that way then it continues to produce. So let's go back to the power now. We can bring power across. We'll just see. It should make it. Yeah. Here. And just put it right about. Ooh. We have to put two in. Go like here and here. And we'll put a light in play. And this should function as I would expect. Yeah. I think that's perfect. You don't need it to be very fast. You just need to produce a stack of these and then just to keep it topped up. That's it. Plain and simple. We might need those, but I'd have no idea. And if so, we can always re redo the setup. You can always change the, the lines, how we have them coming off. And yeah, so let's see here. See how this, I'm just kind of watching the production. So you kind of have to sit there and watch it sometimes. 
and see what is happening. And I think they're both producing, I think, about the same pace now. I think. Oh, wait. No, not. Look, I took that out as well. Silly me. There we go. Now we got them all operating as what we need. They're not always running, but they seem to to be running like good enough there has to be a better way of producing us I just haven't figured it out or I haven't sat there and think about it I haven't brought the materials in a different way maybe if you brought the materials in one you close on the one side and then far on the other side and then same with the other material kind of close on the one side and far on the other side then you'd have an equal distribution and then just flip it for the other side and throw them all into the same line. I'll kind of show you what I mean. I'm going to do that here. I'll probably end up cutting this and creating another bank. We'll see how this runs, though. Yeah, now it looks like there's not enough of this stuff coming down. But it's going. It's going. We could add in... Basically, we could do it like this. Let's see... Am I crafting these things? I don't think I am. What do we need? We need a bunch of stuff. No, okay. One, two, three. So it looks like we need more material. More of this stuff. How about steel? We need some steel. Grab 100 steel plates. Got enough copper. Why did I build more of the, of the... Oh yeah, because we picked up for the stone. Because we need to, to think about making more... Uh, that's right, we were going to make doors. Oh boy, folks. So much, so much. I usually do them about three across. And usually add more. So this is stone here. So maybe we can create production facility right here. So let's see here. Let's see what we have or what we're working with. What's going on here? Although we do have a balancer up here, but it's not it's not functioning. Well it's because mainly the one side is being consumed all the way down, right? Even right here. If you could have something that would load both sides into it, it'd be fine. But oh whatever. I'm actually gonna Yeah, I'm just gonna do that. Let's put in a wall down here. Let's kind of start the process of blocking things off. We'll do that. Just a small, simple wall. And then we should carry on the wall this way. So let's see here. Cut the coal line. Put this in. Do that. And we'll drop underneath and so basically what we're going to do is we're just going to encircle this part here this is what we need right we need the the stone to continue building our walls so let's just kind of see what we can clear out here okay shabam shabam see here okay excellent let's keep going down the way here perfect man <laughs> If I had something interesting to talk about, I would talk about it with you, but I don't. So that's why I have the music kind of loud, so you can kind of listen as you as you watch me play.
it's like people like people asking oh what do you like to watch or what sports do you like or all this this verbal salad is what i call it because it's 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 what it is what's a salad right you know lettuce and maybe some toppings it tastes really good but really it's nothing right so that's the same what people engage in is is they like to engage in what i call is verbal salad and it just basically means that they talk about nothing uh, for me sports are nothing for me anything asking like oh what do you like that's i don't know i find it really odd that we would identify things or you know, like things a lot and i don't know it just it, to me it doesn't make sense because <laughs> it's a uh, it's almost like a childish concept so why have we grown up past the childish concepts on this world you know i think that's why we're we're in the trouble that that we're in or that's why the world is doing what it's doing because it's in a childlike state it's never grown up to be an adult to be to move on from you know petty things like racism and prejudice and all that stuff right so some of you might not agree which is fine but that's of course just my opinion so yeah but that's just what i see because you can see it you know, out and about when you're out and about in civilization to see what people are like you know even you know the gamer community itself is pretty toxic it's filled with a bunch of kitties and you know everything and who who think they know what they know but they don't because they're only like like kitties they're they're 12 13 14 15 16 you know they have plenty of time to play video games and all that fun stuff and me well i play when i can i play when the family allows it so like right now because the one child i have is in daycare and the other one is still newborn so mama's with that one and yeah it's just just cool that way that's how we roll all right and so things get busy when the little guy when the one child i have who's three and a half when he's at home then he wants attention and so as a good father is usually you're there playing with the kid and make sure the kids doing what they're supposed to do and yada 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 you know the usual verbal salad <laughs> um yeah and so that's just the reasoning why i'm i haven't been able to produce a constant stream of videos i do plan on getting back to that i do plan on on doing that so let's see what we have our first time oh 10 minutes left so what are we gonna do with that 10 minutes well you know how we tore up the the doorway right well let's just reinstall that door right here let's put it right in here this is actually a good spot no biters should be able to come through now. That's all secured up. Let's see if we can actually place one more. Where is it? Where's my walls? Yeah, we can. That's what I wanted, just to make sure it's fully blocked up. Now let's go down here and check out what's happening with the coal. The coal's not very th uh, thick. What's this? Oh, that's the power line. We jutted it over because uh, we want it to go up with the line. We kind of didn't line it up correctly, but okay, here we go. Okay, I'm gonna just kind of chop up a row of trees going up this way. Really, we need to chop up some trees here, here, there. Okay, and then I need to make some more doors. Actually, no, I don't. I don't need to. One, two, three. Okay. Here we are. We're in this part of the woods. This is more iron. So we basically need to add some more of these bad boys. Let's just add four more. Like so. Oh, are we out? Dang it. So we'll just build one. But see, look how, uh, how many resources it uses. This marathon mode, man, it's, it's, it's tough. I feel it. It's gonna be so many episodes. Like I'm gonna have to do you know, literally hundreds of these of these videos to do anything like that. The hundreds, maybe. I don't know. I don't think so. But <laughs> it's gonna feel like that because, man, this stuff is is, is you gotta produce a lot. 
I thought I was up for the challenge and I was originally way back at the start of the year but then your life happened and things just got really busy for me so there we go we got more iron or iron why did I say iron we have more coal on the on the run here kind of make our way back up just kind of chop some trees on the way back up just to widen this area a little bit and we'll have to create that stone facility there so we can continue producing stone go up this way we'll follow the power line well, I guess we follow this line then we could get oh I guess the door would be better on this side instead of this side so we'll do that there's fish there yeah, this would be a better spot for the door okay so here we are so we're gonna have to produce stone so where are we gonna do that are we gonna bring the stone across and do it over here probably it's probably a good idea maybe we'll bring the stone up here so we should have actually maybe left the production here because we could have brought it up and that's probably what we're going to do so which means we're going to redo that all of that so we, that means we can take this out replace it with the belt there's balancer here which kind of is working but kind of not so how's this all producing looks like the plates are producing looks like the those are producing and then these are producing so we obviously produce more on the one well see actually this side is the side that's going to be constantly in use until it's backed up and it backs all the way up but you can obviously tell that this has hit a cap which is 50 which is fine which is amazing okay and yeah look at this this is cool this is this factory is working out quite nicely i'm quite impressed with with how i have it it functioning here and i think i'm going to call this one a little bit early i'm kind of all gamed out here i'm out of ideas we built the we added this on we made this function we we kind of made this work a little bit better so now it's producing way more we we made sure we uh, we added the copper so we kind of added more miners i knew that would be all mined out very quickly it was just, it was a very small deposit here so we can take that this okay perfect so that can continue and what else do we do we also kind of change the wall configuration here to enclose this stone here that we want to tap into and then we're we also ran down here to kind of tweak this a little bit and you add some more coal so that way we have more more fuel coming down the line some more biters coming in for the death there we go and so that's it folks thank you everybody for watching hopefully you've enjoyed this episode and i look forward to seeing you in the next one Bye-bye.